everyone, I am back with a another haul. This gigantic box came for me yesterday. Um, I mean, look at that, it's literally like the size of me. Inside this box is a massive order of autumn clothes from H&M. It's going to take me ages to get into this. Right, here we go. So, now these two kind of go together. I got this short cropped poplin shirt. It does need an iron. It's long sleeve cropped with this brown vest. Oh my gosh, I saw this and I was like, ah! So this, and it's like a nice little cropped one as well to go with the cropped shirt. Just gonna try these on, see what they look like. Okay, well guys, excuse the fact that this needs an iron, but how cute is this? Just this little like cropped vest in a lovely brown autumn colour. Because I hate them, you know when you get them big oversized shirts and they just like pour out of the vest. And you literally have to like tuck them in and then you look like you've chucked a load of like random rubbish into your pants. Yeah, but this because it's cropped, like the shirt comes, the shirt comes down to here. So you can literally just be free, float about. I'll go with how cute this is. I love this. So the next thing I got was this like casual kind of shirt. Let me just open it up. So this it says Wyoming USA. Don't know what that means. This would look great with you know like a pair of jeans as you're going out for your day, as you're going to uni. So let me just do the button up. This Look at the sleeves. Got this bit of brown hair, bit of brown hair. That's what it looks like from a side angle. I love this. I actually wasn't really too sure about this when I looked at it. And then now I've got it out of the bag and actually on. I think it looks great. I think it's just such a easy throw on when you can't really be bothered to put anything decent on. Just throw this on, pair of jeans, pair of trainers. Be sorted. This next item is an essential for this time of year. Can't go into autumn without a knitted jumper. Oh wow, it's actually really thick, like really thick material. This is what it looks like. If you can see, it's got a slight turtleneck, a bit cropped. I mean, this material is actually really thick. It looks like something your nan's knitted, like really well. You wouldn't even need to wear a coat with this. Wow, wow, wow. This is what it looks like from the side. Really love this, you know. Chilled, comfy vibes. This is definitely probably going to get a lot of wear out with this. You only wake up in the morning and it's really cold and you just don't want to get out of bed. Chuck this on, you will be extra toasty um i don't know whether to just talk get changed then go into the next thing you know what i'm staying in this because i have to keep to putting on a different jumper it's getting really annoying um i don't know why i don't just film the intros and then do the try-ons because i'm literally just trying it on <laughs> doing it in the, that black jumper and then taking the jumper off to try it on and then taking this off to put the jumper back on to try it on again. Why am I doing that? You know what? I'm staying in this and I'm showing you the next one in this. This, oh, this is just like a bit basic. But, you know, got to have a few basics in your wardrobe. I mean, my whole wardrobe is basically basic, so it will. But, yes, this is just a black top. I really love black tops, black jumpers, black anything. I wear black most of the time. I feel like when you've got lighter hair like and you wear black your hair stands out more whereas if you've got darker hair and you wear like cream neutral colors hair stands out is that really, does anyone think like that or is that just me probably just me okay so this is the top um this is it from the side it's quite cropped so i've got a top underneath this so excuse that um just quite cropped i think i'd wear this with a jacket actually i do have a perfect jacket that would go with this. Get it out actually. So I bought a baseball jacket. I'm wearing these at the moment and you know what? They look really trendy. I can't 
can't not get one brown and neutral beige colors then this is the back so this is the jacket how lovely is this this is from the side the side angle the back the front i love this i will definitely be wearing this for uni probably gonna wear this on monday actually but yeah how lovely is this these are the sleeves lovely absolutely gorgeous so what do we have next could it not buy a well just get the name of it i think it's like a double breasted is that the right word double breasted double breasted blazer this is it it looks quite long um so i'm just gonna try this one well right it is quite long um where's my bucket that i can stand on it is quite long actually like, maybe a bit too long but you could wear this for like day drink maybe bottomless brunching i don't really know if this suits me i think it's just a bit too long but i think that's the look got it in a small maybe a sh i don't know but oh well never mind so what do we have next in the box it's these boots that are taking up loads of room let me just explain these boots i don't know how much i'm going to show you these on maybe i won't be able to show them on oh my gosh these are these are actually are to die for not really a boot kind of girl but definitely am now these are i think these are called funky like chelsea boots i'm just gonna try them on i won't be able to show them i don't know how i'm gonna be able to show them wow they are chunky um we try and Come on, just to see a dance. <laughs> to be fair, that is my left leg, isn't it? Right, let's see how high I can get this leg. And this is a really bad way of showing them. Maybe I should just like insert a clip of me wearing them. I mean, they're nice. They're just a bit chunky at the toe. They look a bit like, I don't know, Jack and the Beanstalk shoes. They really have shoes like this. Thinking of like big foot. Just rather large, I've creased them already. Oops, not actually too sure. I don't know whether they'll just look really weird on me because I've got really little feet. I think I'm like a size three to four in feet. So I've got these in a four. They do fit, but they're just very chunky. But then I suppose that is the look. I think I'd have to wear like leggings, maybe like leather leggings or, or like ribbed seamless leggings that would look quite nice with these actually is this the last bit oh no oh yes i think it actually is yes 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 this is more like autumn fall color but it's more like for going out it's a bodysuit yeah just like a cute little bodysuit probably wear this with with the baseball jacket it probably actually look really nice with that but i'm just going to try this on and then see what it looks like well this is the bodysuit. Um, obviously, it wouldn't be worn with these joggers. Um, this is it from the side, the back. I could wear this if I was going out. It's maybe not like an everyday thing, but yeah, I think it's cute. It's like square neck type thing. Um, and then yeah, it's just a bodysuit. I actually hate bodysuits. I'm not gonna lie, they are the most annoying things especially when you're out and if you break the seal you have to go for a wee every five minutes and you're trying to do your bodysuit back I'm trying to do honestly if someone saw a video of me in the cubicles when i'm drunk trying to do my bodysuit up that'd get me some views that is actually everything um it's all now just on a pile on my bed which i need to sort out but i actually I don't think there was one thing in there that I wasn't, oh well, apart from the blazer actually and the boots. So yeah, maybe there was a couple of things that I was a bit unsure about. But everything else, love. Uh, if you liked everything in the video, I will link it down below. I'll also link all the sizes. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you haven't already. It's actually getting into winter now, so, well, close to winter. It's probably gonna do some 
winter hauls. I think I'm gonna start posting Thursdays and Sundays. Definitely Sundays, but maybe a different day in the week. So let me know what days you want me to post and I'm gonna have like set scheduled days. I'm gonna try and do two a week. I am in my third year of uni, so probably wasn't the wisest of ideas to start a YouTube channel at the start of my third year because it's gonna be very stressful and I've got loads to do, like so much work. But you know, it's the dedication that counts. So like, subscribe, and I shall see you next time. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you.